a rare occurrence unfolded as a golden retriever welcomed a unique puppy. What happened next was heartwarming. Kwan, a majestic golden retriever, embarked on a remarkable journey as she carried the precious cargo of her second litter. The memory of her first pregnancy lingered when she had gracefully nurtured five adorable pups. Rio, as she was affectionately called by her devoted owner, Miss Louise Sutherland of Scotland, had proven herself an exceptional mother during that initial experience. However, this time, there was an air of anticipation and excitement tinged with caution. The veterinarian had revealed that Kwan was carrying not just a few, but a significant number of pups, far more than the first time. The news prompted Louise to be extra attentive, with the doctor emphasizing the need for careful monitoring during the impending birth. Rio's well-being became the top priority, and Louise, already enamored with her dog companion, eagerly stepped up to the responsibility. The upcoming delivery was approaching rapidly, and Kwan's every move was watched with concern and excitement. Louise, besottled by the remarkable qualities of her golden retriever, couldn't help but marvel at the prospect of expanding their furry family. The idea of sharing the love and joy that Rio brought into her life by having her offspring was irresistible. Louise eagerly anticipated the arrival of Kwan's second litter, reflecting on their unique bond. More than just a pet, Kwan is the apple of Louise's eye, providing unwavering companionship and unconditional love. This desire to share the joy of having a golden retriever drives Louise's decision. Kwan's impending delivery promises adorable pups and a cherished legacy. Committed to responsible dog care, Louise ensures Kwan's optimal health throughout the pregnancy undergoing sonar examinations and diligent veterinary consultations. On the day of delivery, it arrived precisely on schedule, 63 days after conception. Louise marveled at the specialized equipment displaying not just one or two, but nine distinct little heads and heartbeats. A delightful surprise that exceeded her expectations. A litter of this size was considered substantial for a golden retriever, a breed that produced between four to 12 pups. Yet, as Louise reveled in the miraculous sight before her, she couldn't help but acknowledge the potential toll such a significant litter might take on Kwan's health. The anticipation welcoming nine precious additions to their family was tempered by the realization that Rio, their devoted and expectant mother, would need extra care and attention during and after the birthing process. Rio instinctively sought a soft, quiet resting place to prepare for the momentous occasion. Her maternal instincts kicked in, guiding her to create a sanctuary where she could gently bring her adorable golden brood into the world. The air was filled with a palpable sense of excitement and anticipation as the day unfolded, marking the beginning of a new chapter in the intertwined lives of Louise and her extraordinary golden retriever, Kwan. Having been well prepared for the upcoming event, Louise had given Rio a spacious crate, generously filled with soft blankets large enough for both. This cozy haven became the stage for the miraculous arrival of Kwan's nine precious pups. Positioned at Rio's side, Louise was armed with a kit of essentials, a mucus sucker, bottles of water, gloves, towels, paper tissues, and a set of nine puppy-sized collars, each adorned with a different color. This thoughtful touch would help Louise keep track of each pup, a vital detail in the days ahead. As Rio settled into labor, Louise remained steadfast, ready to assist with the arrival of each new life. The process unfolded, and Louise miraculously recorded the birth of each pup. The proud mother, Kwan, contributed seven energetic boys and one adorable girl to the growing dog family. Louise carefully weighed each newborn with pride and joy and noted their birth weights. Brightly colored collars, like tokens of individuality, were gently placed around the neck of each pudgy pup. Louise marveled at the uniqueness of each, a colorful distinction that would prove invaluable in the days to come. After this initial inspection, the pups were returned to the watchful care of their mother, Rio. Louise allowed them to nestle close to Rio, allowing the proud mother to clean them up and let them drink some milk, fostering the crucial early bond between mother and pups. As the days unfolded, Louise attentively observed the growth of the newborns. Puppies, born blind and deaf, embarked on a journey of discovery during their first few weeks. Their world was simply filled with sleep, meals, and the inevitable but endearing activities of puppyhood, eating, and of course, the less glamorous side, producing tiny but adorable messes. 
With a heart full of affection, Louise embraced the charming chaos that came with these delightful bundles of joy. In the intimate bond of motherhood, Rio's dedication mirrored the dependency of her newborn pups on her for sustenance, warmth, and affection. Much like the maternal care Louise provided for Rio during this challenging period, Rio, in turn, proved to be an exceptional mother to her litter of nine. The birthing process, though familiar from Rio's previous experience, took an unexpected turn with the arrival of the middle pup. The first pup, stubbornly stuck, prompted worry to creep into Louise's thoughts. It became an all-hands-on-deck situation as Louise and her daughter, Claire, worked diligently to free the pup and safely guide him into the world. The initial challenge was overcome. A cascade of puppies followed. However, an intriguing twist emerged during the birthing process. Rio, midway through delivering her litter, took an unexpected pause. For about 15 minutes, a semblance of calm settled in. Just when it seemed Rio was catching her breath, another puppy entered, followed swiftly by another. It was as if this eager pup couldn't wait to join the world, arriving with remarkable speed after the fourth. The astonishment deepened when Louise at 54 and Claire at 36 beheld the peculiar sight of the new pup. It wasn't due to any deformity or lack of charm. The dog shared the same size, weight, and general appearance as its siblings. What captivated them was the peculiar coloration, a hue unlike any they had seen in a dog before. Though fitting seamlessly into the litter in every other aspect, the pup stood out as a unique and beautiful odd addition to the growing family. The unexpected twist added an element of wonder to the already joyous occasion, making the birth of Quan's second litter an unforgettable and enchanting experience for Louise and Claire. The peculiar mossy green hue that adorned the aptly named Forrest, one of Quan's pups, puzzled Louise and Claire. Forrest's parents were purebred golden retrievers, as their name suggested, possessing the characteristic golden coat associated with the breed. Variations within the golden spectrum were acceptable, including dark golden, cream-like golden, and variations between. However, Forrest's unconventional coloring stood out like a vibrant anomaly. The mystery behind Forrest's unique coloration was unraveled through an intriguing biological phenomenon. It was traced back to a biopigment called biliverdin, closely linked to green. Biliverdin is the same chemical that causes the greenish tint when bruises change color during healing. In Forrest's case, an unusually high concentration of biliverdin in the amniotic fluid surrounding him during birth led to the staining of his fur. The placenta, known as the birth sac, encapsulates each puppy and holds a higher concentration of biliverdin. As the amniotic fluid enveloped Forrest, every inch of his light-colored fur absorbed the green pigment, resulting in its distinctive coloring. While Forrest's head appeared almost ordinary at first glance, a closer inspection revealed variations in the muzzle, paws, and ears area, where the green stain either didn't take well or manifested in a darker shade. This unusual occurrence was not a product of Photoshop magic, but a genuine and rare event. Forrest's case added to the scant three documented instances of green-coated puppies known before him. Thanks to the internet, dog owners worldwide share the unique stories of their green-coated pups, each bestowed with equally charming and whimsical names. The rarity of such a phenomenon resonated across the globe connecting dog enthusiasts and sparking conversations about the incredible diversity that nature could unveil, even in the world of man's best friend. In an extraordinary twist of dog births, a green-coated puppy named Fiona surprised Louise while delivering a chocolate Labrador's litter in Lancashire. This rare phenomenon echoed trends seen in Spain and with a Great Dane perplexing Louise and veterinarians. Closer investigation revealed the green hue was linked to the placenta, a captivating aspect of dog biology. Fiona, part of a litter of nine, marked Rio's second venture into motherhood, with this delivery proving both extraordinary and challenging. A marathon 32-hour labor resulting in the unique birth of Forrest, distinguishable by his unconventional green coat. Despite the extended labor and the surprise, Rio became a resilient and caring mother. After a well-deserved rest and thorough washdown, Rio and the entire family were understandably tired but content. Reflecting on the event, Louise admired the family's commitment to caring for Rio throughout the ordeal. With each finding a new home, the puppies left an incredible mark on the Sutherland family. However, Louise couldn't resist the allure of keeping one for herself. The decision was yet to be made, with Louise admitting, we're keeping one of the boys, but haven't decided yet. We're waiting until their personalities come out.
With his unique coloring and captivating story, Four seemed to be a strong contender for a permanent place in the Sutherland household. Share your thoughts on this remarkable story. We value your input. So please take a moment to express your opinions and insights in the comment section down below. Your feedback is greatly appreciated. Thank you.